What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Me and Porter. You don't want to look at the people? Uh. <laughs> Me and Porter are out here today. Nice sunny day. First day of March. March 1st today. Finally in March, guys. Free spawn is coming right around the corner. We're going to start getting into a lot of bass fishing catches here. Still going to go for everything because, hey, fishermen at heart, guys. Fishermen at in the bottom of my heart, I'm a just a fisherman and so I just like catching fish so these are just fishing adventures we're gonna bass fish for a little bit this morning see if we can't get on any bass I got a jig tied on a flat sided crankbait I got a jerk bait I got a net rig got a drop shot those are the baits I have tied on right now that's what we're gonna start with we'll try for bass for a while probably give it the first two hours of the day and then we'll go looking for just anything that'll bite later on but before we get into fishing guys I want to read you the verse of the day today's verse comes from Psalms chapter 91 verses 1 and 2 it says Whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. I'll read it one more time for you guys. This is Psalms 91 verse 1 and 2. Whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. God, I thank you for this day, Lord. I thank you for uh, this beautiful weather. I thank you for this time we get to spend on the water. I ask you to keep us safe, watch over us. Father, I just pray that anyone who doesn't know you, Lord, will come to know you through these Bible readings. Anyone who already knows you, Lord, will come to know you better, God. I thank you for everything you've given me and done in my life. We love you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Let's see if we can get some bass today. Fish in general. We'll be happy with any fish catches. Water temps today, guys, are 41 degrees today, so that's a little warmer than the last time I was out here. Still not great, but 41 is better than 39, which was what the water temp was in my last video. Different lake. I don't know if I mentioned where we are at Tanawax today. This is Lake Tanawax. Let me get off this really kind of when, when you get up everything off because I don't want to get hooked. And I just threw that lily back in. Time to go to the other side, reel up.
try two more spots, and if we don't get anything, we're gonna go home. Okay. back on because I know you're cold. Cold, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Knew it. You are tough, though. Mm -hmm. You are tough, though. Mm -hmm. No, you're tough. Uh-huh. No, you're... Bro, you're tough. Yes! I'm going to put my hand warmers next to it so then they can get back their warm and, and so they get toasty. Okay. Got him. We got one, Porter. Yay! Yeah! I hope Ooh. it's a rainbow trout. Might be, dude. Feels like a good one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Woo! Good old rainbow, baby. You got a rainbow? Woo! You got a rainbow in the wind. No skunk, thank you, Jesus. That's a good one. What do you think? Mm -hmm. oh, it on All right, guys. Oh! Are we keeping them? You want to? Yes. Okay. We'll give him the papa. He'll love it. No skunk, guys! I thought we were gonna get skunk today. We've been fishing around. We bass fish for a little bit this morning. And then I trying to fish for perch or panfish for a while. And my motor, my trolling motor battery is, I need a new one. So it doesn't last that long. And the bass fishing killed the motor, basically. I had very little motor power. And uh, so dropping to the panfish was like really difficult. It was hard to do. So I was like, man, this is no good. So I, uh, I was like, this isn't working. I can't stay over these fish. I have no motor. I, I just kept drifting around. So I decided to anchor up, throw out a trout line. Boom, nice trout. This, I'm gonna measure it up. Rainbow trout, what do you think, buddy? Good. Uh, yeah, it's probably like a 15 incher, 14, 15 incher. Wind's blowing me. Looks like my anchors aren't holding right now. I gotta, give me, give me a sec, guys. We're getting crazy. Let me see if I can get these anchors to hold this time. All right, guys, check him out. Woo! Probably, I'm gonna measure him real quick, see how, see how long he is. He's right at 15 inches. Nice, nice 15 inch trout. What do you think, bud? Good. Good? Kiss him? <laughs> you do it! Mmm. All right, we're gonna see if we can get another one. That was that was pretty cool. So, no skunk. Whew, thank you, Jesus. Woo -hoo -hoo. I'll show you the setup we're using. It's the same setup I set up the other day on the giveaway video where I tried for trout and we didn't catch nothing. Literally, I haven't done anything different. Had the same baits and everything on it. It's just these power egg, orange and yellow, chartreuse color type power eggs. About a two foot liter or so, swiveling weight, so it's, and then when this hits the ground, this these power bait these power eggs float up, so that it's off the sits off the ground like an inch or so, uh, about a foot or so off the ground, two feet off the ground. So that's the setup, just that Carolina rig that we set up last time and didn't catch nothing. I cannot figure out why my anchors won't hold. What is happening, guys? Shoot, What's wrong with you guys? I think maybe we're too shallow, I don't know. Try anchor, anchoring right there. Cast out again. That happened like really, really quick. I only, I had just thrown out and I was just, I mean, maybe 30 seconds after I set up and casted, that trout hit, so. It'd be cool to get a few.
be our last, that's my last cast, okay? Deal? Last cast? Deal. We'll go home after this. Even if we catch one, we'll still go home after this cast. Yeah. And that, and you can turn that rainbow trout, it will be... Two rainbow trout. No, it will be, uh, that rainbow trout brother. Oh yeah, probably. Dave. No, he... His brother's name is Cucumber. That's his brother's brother. name is Cucumber? Uh-huh. Can I tell what this Why? guy's name is? Yeah, what's this trout's name? Chicken wing. Chicken wing? Yeah. Nice. Uh-huh. Where does he live so I can catch him? Where you caught chicken wing? Mm-hmm. Probably. That's where he is. He was at his house. They were yeah. hanging out. Yeah. Mm. I threw back over there. I didn't get no bites. He must have left. Chicken wing, I mean cucumber. cucumber. Yeah. Then they're they're going on a bike ride. Yeah, maybe that's. What yep. Or ride. Oh, we're getting a bite. I hope it's cucumber, right? Got him. Yeah, we got another one. It's cucumber, Porter. Promise? Yes. How do you know it's rainbow? Well, I'm just guessing because I'm using power bait. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's cucumber all right. Woo, another good one. That's it's, definitely his brother. Because it's rim, he's a rainbow trout? Yeah, they look like twins. That is cucumber for sure. Yep, that's cucumber. Woo. All right, guys, got another one. Cucumber. Porter named this one cucumber. <laughs> <laughs> he says it's the first one's brother. Man, it's probably 14, 15, I'll measure it up. I bet you it's 14 or 15 inches. A little smaller. This is the little brother porter because this one's 14 inches. Got one that's 15 and one that's 14. Really awesome. I told Porter, I just threw that cast out. I said, hey buddy, this is our last cast because he's getting cold. It is cold out here. The wind's blowing, he's bundled up. You're not freezing though, right? Yeah, not too cold. I say he's not freezing, he's just cold. And so, and we've been out here for a minute. So I said, last cast, dude, no matter what, we're gonna, we're going after this and got him on the last cast. So that's really cool. We ended up getting two fish today, guys. We spent about two hours today bass fishing. Didn't catch anything, no bites. Just tried going for perch and crappie and panfish, but uh, I just couldn't stay over with my, with my trolling motor being so low on battery. I just, the wind was blowing too much. I couldn't stay over them. So we anchored up and we salvaged the day with two trout, two nice trout. I'll get the other one out. We'll show you both of them. Chicken wing and cucumber, right bud? Is that what you're calling them? That's Chicken. their name. All right. Two really great trout guys. Super awesome day. Did you have fun, buddy? Mm -hmm. Porter had fun, I had fun. Hope you guys had fun too. If you did, smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Leave me a comment. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers, guys. Let's get it, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll do it again. Okay, hang on.